Hey everybody, uh, Victor here from the Nerdy Tribunal. For today's Nerdy Update, we're going to go over two little tidbits that we kind of came upon for the upcoming film Spider-Man Homecoming, releasing in less than a month. We know that Bokeem Woodman is playing the Shocker, but one thing we saw on the IMDB page is that he's playing Herman Schultz, which is Comic 616 Universe Shocker, but it says that he's playing Shocker number two, which is kind of weird because you think about it, there's usually only one villain of the same name in a movie. So in the recent Disney's behind the scenes look at Homecoming, we had a part where Tom Holland, who's playing Peter Parker, AKA Spider-Man, is talking about the new cast. But we know that Logan Marshall Green will be playing Shocker number one, AKA Bryce. This kind of ties into the spectacular Spider-Man cartoon where the Shocker is henchman Jackson Bryce. So it's a little bit interesting to see that there will be two Shockers in this movie. We don't know exactly how that's going to pan out, but I, I'm assuming maybe one dies or one gets locked up and another Shocker comes out. We'll have to wait and see. The second tidbit is a little bit more interesting because we know that Donald Glover is part of the cast, but no one so far was able to determine who he's playing. In the same scene where Tom Holland kind of goes through the cast list, we see that Donald Glover is going to be playing a character that goes by the name of Aaron Davis. So for those that might not know too much about the comic book universe, the name Aaron Davis is quite a big deal in the Ultimate Universe. Uh, universe 1610. The big reveal is that Aaron Davis is the Prowler in the Ultimate Universe. He's a little bit different from the Prowler in the 616 comic universe, whereas he's kind of a more of a bad guy that turns kind of good. But the biggest thing it kind of leads to is that Aaron Davis is the uncle of Miles Morales. For those that don't know, Miles Morales is the Ultimate Spider-Man. Aaron Davis is kind of the reason how Miles Morales became Spider-Man. Just kind of a quick overview. Aaron Davis was hired by Roxxon, which you kind of seen in a lot of the Marvel uh, Netflix series and MCU. But in the Ultimate Universe, Roxxon hired uh, Davis to steal from Oscorp. So during the heist, one of the spiders there that's been infused with the Oz formula uh, manages to catch a ride with the Prowler and basically when he gets home, the spider comes out and eventually bites Miles Morales which turns him into the Ultimate Spider-Man. So this kind of leads to what's happening with the whole Miles Morales Ultimate Spider-Man in the MCU now. Are we going to see two Spider-Mans in the MCU? Are we going to see one or the other? Like what's going to happen? There's so many ways this can go which is why this is such a big thing to find out. So let me know what your thoughts are. Thank you for listening. Please subscribe, like, share, and until next time.